an upset occurred in Division I women's basketball. Number three, Colorado lost to number five, UCLA. The final score was 76 to 68. So what exactly happened? Colorado was up 35-32 at halftime. And this means no unbeatens in terms of conference play for the Pac-12 in women's basketball. In the second half, UCLA scored 44 points. Colorado scored 33. I'm going to double check real fast if in the last two and a half minutes there was a little bit of foul game. By the way, I'm going to double check that right now. But I'm still going to go over it anyway. There was not really. But 2.15 left. UCLA, Lauren Bett made one out of two free throws after a foul on call runners. Quay Miller. But 2.02 left. Gerard, Jalen Sherrod turned the ball over, which was stolen by Charisma Osborne. And UCLA called timeout with 1.51 left. In the game, then one like 142, Lauren Bad made bets made a free I mean layup to be up 70 to 62. Colorado called timeout with 130 left. And Frida Foreman made a three pointer assisted by Kendall Wet Weta to get UCLA only up 70 to 65 at the time. 109 left foul on Quay Miller from Colorado. Gabriello ja Jack Jacquez. Or something like that. I apologize. J A Q U E Z made both free throws, seventy-two to sixty-five at the time. Fifty around fifty-seven seconds left. Aaron Vonley missed a layup, which the rebound defensive rebound was by Lena Songtag from UCLA. Around 40, 54 seconds left. Fifty-one seconds left, or something like that. There's a foul on Frida Foreman from Colorado. Charisma Osborne made both free throws. 674 to 65. Around 41 seconds left, Jerry and Sharon missed a three, but Lauren Betts from UCLA got the defensive rebound. Around 14 seconds left, UCLA made a made a layup, and there was around three seconds left. There was a foul on UCLA by, from Lena Songtag, but Frida Foreman from Colorado made all three free throws. The UCLA called timeout, and they, they got the ball inbounded, and that was a game. That's just a FYI on that. Now I'm going to go over some stats for the game. Game here and points out Turner's favorite Colorado, fourteen to eight. Fast break points nine to seven in favor of UCLA, but points in the paint thirty six to twenty two in favor of UCLA. So, yeah, that's definitely another one of those areas that UCLA exploited, but Colorado. Didn't shoot the ball bad in this game. 42.3% from the field on 52 attempts. 30% on threes on 20 attempts. 75% on free throws on 24 attempts. 20, 27 rebounds. Now six of those offensive. 14 assists. Four steals. Three blocks. 16 turns. 27 fouls. Okay. One plus three. That's four plus four. That's eight plus seven. That's 15 points. And four double digit scores in this game that combined for... Okay, 10 plus 10, that's 20. Plus 16, that's 36. Plus 17, that's 53 points. And one other player with six or more points went seven. Now, UCLA had eight bench points, and they had four double-digit scores themselves. They combined for, okay, 11 plus 20 is 31. Plus 12, that's 43. Plus 22 is 65 points. And they did have like, one other player with six or more points in this game with six, so... And UCLA didn't shoot the ball as good as Colorado, 39.3% from the field, but on 61 attempts, though, and 25% on threes on 16 attempts, but 80% on free throws on 30 attempts. 44 rebounds, 18 of those offensive, 5 assists, 5 steals, 4 blocks, 14 turns, 19 fouls. So, this does affect the NCAA tournament seeding and pack down the line, down the line here, and as well as the Pac-12 tournament in terms of where which team's going to finish first now potentially in colorado you got a doozy coming up 
you got number six USC coming up right at you, and you lost to number five at home. You're going to have to face number six at home. You got at Oregon State, at Oregon. You got at Washington State. You got at Washington. Now, for UCLA, on the other hand, what's the next five games? You got at number 20, Utah, which currently, as of this recording, they're up on on USC, so beware. And you got Washington at home. Washington State at, ho I mean, at home. So, and after that, the next two games are at Cal and at number 8, Stanford. And Stanford was up big on on Oregon, but Oregon's somewhat climbing back. They're only down ten as of right now, like twenty five fifteen, but with end of the first quarter, so they were down twelve nothing, Oregon was, so or something like that. So anyways, if you like this content, hit like and subscribe it. See you guys later on the road of six hundred subscribers, course ultimate goal. It's a thousand more, so we might know what this course like in the video. Comment video really helps the YouTube algorithm so more people can see it. Sharing the video does help as well so more people can watch. And if you're watching and you're not subscribed, hit subscribe button. It's free to notification bell as well.